At the 2023 USATF Championships, a specific athlete, at the age of 17, did something vastly unexpected by making both the 100 and 200 meters finals against her senior counterparts. Her name is none other than Mia Braha Peterson. As an Oregon native, this junior track sensation really caught our eyes. And despite the poor data collection from World Athletics, one thing I can say from the results I've seen is that she's a very consistent athlete. Each time she runs, the times are within the same range. Last year's, she set personal bests of 11.01 seconds and 22.58 seconds outdoor. And on the indoor circuit, she ran 7.26 seconds and 22.89 seconds. Already this season, we have seen her beat her 60 meters best, clocking 7.22 seconds in a race where she said she was disappointed in her start. When that is fixed, just imagine how much faster she will go. We also saw her go just three hundredths of a second outside, her indoor 200 meters personal best clocking 22 to 92 seconds over the weekend. Our next young talent is Adeja Hodge, although she made her name way back in 2022 at the Carifta Games in Jamaica, not too long after her 16th birthday. Jamaica is known for having outstanding athletes both young and old, but she totally dominated the under-18 category. Given that it's 2024, and I'm still talking about her shows that she has been consistent in her progression. An example of this is, in 2022, her 60 meters personal best was 7.56. It then dropped precipitously to 7.27 in 2023. And already in her first meet, she was able to run 7.24 seconds. Also, in what seems to be her first ever 300 meters, Hodge blasted to 36.97 seconds. The result itself is outstanding. And on a day where she ran four times, shows how good of an athlete she is. Both these girls are incredible athletes. Pedersen is committed to USC and Hodge is committed to University of Georgia. And if they continue on this path, it's set the expectation for some good battles in high school right now and for the NCAA next year. Let me know what you guys think about these athletes in the comments. Until next time, Tracklytics out.